Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Jose Ramos, a flight attendant, personal trainer, and a fitness model. Today, I'm here to show you what it takes to stay healthy. You must meal prep, correct? So I have all my meal prep there, ready to go. And I'm gonna show you guys what I am going to actually be making today for a three day trip that I have coming up. Stay tuned. What am I going to be making today? Today, again, I have a three day trip. So what I am going to be making today will be overnight oatmeal, which consists of chia seeds, flax seeds, dried cranberries, hemp seeds, and then of course the oatmeal. Then I have my quinoa, which is going to be combined with chicken breast, organic chicken breast. I have my bread here, I'm gonna be making sandwiches, Swiss cheese and turkey. Here I have all my veggies, again, stay green, stay on the green side, avocados, peppers, cucumbers, onions, I have sweet potato, I have here tomatoes, I have squash, I have my hummus, okay? I have here what is one of the most delicious package I can buy, which is the green cabbage, and it also has carrots and red cabbage inside. And I have my carrots, baby carrots for my hummus. So once again, stay tuned for what I'm gonna be cooking. It's very simple, and uh, this is how I get ready before my three-day trip. So for my three-day trip coming up, I have the chicken breast, it's uh, clean chicken breast, organic chicken. I used olive oil to season it, along with my Himalayan pink salt, paprika. I have the Mr. Dash, which is the chicken for the chicken seasoning. I also have the 21 seasoning, which is from Trader Joe's. I have my black peppers, which I love. And then for my quinoa, I'm going to be using onions, green peppers. I'm going to be using tomato and I'm going to be using squash. Now, when it comes to my healthy snacks, I'm going to be having celery, cucumbers, green peppers and carrots. Okay, those are going to be for my healthy snacks. Okay guys, so everything is ready now to start cooking and I just wanna show you guys how things are coming out. Check this out. One quick trick that I use for the quinoa is I first get the onion, squash, and the green peppers to boil for five minutes and then what I do is I use my quinoa, put it right in here. This has been boiling for five minutes already so what I added in there was salt and 21 seasoning. That 21 seasoning, you can find it at Trader Joe's. And then I just toss it right in here. So that is a Southern, a Southern quinoa. And then before the water dries out, I then dump the tomatoes right inside. Boom, tomatoes. able to see throughout the video. I meal prepped quinoa, I meal prepped the overnight oats, I, I meal prepped um, vegetables for my hummus, I also meal prepped sandwiches which is turkey and cheese on healthy bread. Again remember stay on the healthy side not the unhealthy side. All right. I also have avocado and finally I have some mixed nuts. That's for my three day trip. All right guys, as you were able to see, here I was able to meal prep for three days, meaning that 
I'm going to have enough food, and not only enough food, but healthy food, to be able to be eating the right way, to be able to eat the healthy stuff while I'm flying. And at the same time, that's going to prevent me from even thinking of eating outside, like throughout the terminal, bad food. Uh, sometimes you find good food in the terminal. Don't get me wrong, I've eaten uh, good food throughout the terminals. But at the same time, just think of it this way. Imagine if you were the person to meal prep. I often get people saying, I cannot meal prep, I don't have the time. You must make the time. Because if your body matters, then the time must matter. Meaning that you must make the time in order for you to accomplish what you want to accomplish on your body. So, I didn't obtain my abs from one night to the other. These are results of consistency. You must have consistency while traveling, while working out, while doing anything in life. If you don't have consistency, then you're not going to see results. I'm hoping that you were able to like um, the food content that I put together for you guys. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And if you have any comments, leave them right here down below. Um, I'll be able to reply to you as soon as I can. And once more time, thank you so much for watching Jose Ramos Fit. And I hope to see you again soon on another episode of Staying Healthy with Jose Ramos Fit. Take care, guys.